Hello, everybody. Every organization you're going to see has some type of structure, especially one of a certain size. Structures vary, but in general, structures can fall into one of two areas. One is what's called the mechanistic, and the other is called the organic. So what's the differences between the two, and when should we use one versus the other? Well, the mechanistic is one that is often seen, the example I give is the post office. It's very rigid. It's often a manufacturing base. Uh, they have definitive processes, and the processes involved in a mechanistic are really involved with order. There's very much routine in a mechanistic system. So you have rigid hierarchies, which means that people must report to certain people. And associated with that um, is there's very little, there's great control and very little ingenuity and creativity because everybody has a role and it's expected that each person is going to perform that role. So for those reasons, this type of organization works with very large organizations that do the same thing from task to task. That's mechanistic. The, the other one is called organic, and that's the preferred method, especially for organizations that are just starting out and are looking for ways in which to grab some type of organizational competitive advantage. Most of technology companies start with the organic, um, and then they, so not so much tech companies, but larger companies move into a mechanistic or mechanic because they get larger and they want more control. So for that reason, it tends to start with organic and move to me mechanistic, and it doesn't work out as well when you move along that continuum. But the mechanistic does have advantages, and so does organic. But in this case, organic offers the greatest advantage, and those advantages include that you offer much more creativity and thought processes, some that you just don't see with others. Since it's a much more loose federation of individuals, which means there's less rigid hierarchies and reporting relationships, you allow more decision making at the lower levels of the organization. And that can be quite advantageous as you go through your organization. And as you go through your strategies to create and sell something to others that may work. So for us, we look at the organic as the best. Mechanistic is one that inhibits creativity. Everybody enjoy the day. Take care.